Okay, this is the uh, setup for the UTN smartwatch. Uh, if you turn on Bluetooth on your phone and Bluetooth on your, I should say no. Okay, so first things first, let's take and turn on turn on your Bluetooth, which mine's already on. All right. Then you're going to turn on your turn on your Bluetooth here on your phone. I mean on your watch. Oh, we got it connected. Let me go on and disconnect. Disconnect. Okay, now it's not connected. All right. So what you're going to do? You got to go and uh, take out the manual. And there is a code. Get my camera. There's a code right here in the manual that you're gonna need to flip over. Get the inverse side. All right. You need to scan that with your uh, bar scanner. Go in the App Store, download Bar Scanner, and scan that code. All right. It's gonna download it on my phone whenever I take and pull it down. Right here, smartwatch one APK. And the way I done that, I don't know what kind of phone you have, but uh, my phone, I grab it at the top of the screen there, and just drag it down. And that's gonna be smartwatch APK one. All right, you're gonna hit that, and it's gonna install. All right. Then next, what you're gonna do is you're gonna come over here, and you're gonna turn your watch on. get it back to the beginning okay this is what yours is going to look like uh, minus that tag all right you got the uh, once you hit the Bluetooth that's going to come up then you're going to take your phone go into your Bluetooth I'll turn mine off that way it's not connected all right turn the Bluetooth on now we're going to go into the Bluetooth pops up. All right. I've already got it in there, but what you're going to do, so focus here, you're going to hit scan at the bottom. All right, so scan. Remember, you got your. Your watch is over here, it's just like that still. Alright. So it's gonna find uh, a device called UTN. Alright, so we need to uh, click on UTN. What's gonna happen is your phone's gonna come up and it's gonna have something matched, is what it's gonna say. So take and slide your finger to the left across the screen. Keep the back lid on longer. Alright, your phone's gonna say confirm pass key. Say okay. And the watch is gonna come up and say it's connected. Alright. Your phone's also gonna come up, or your watch is gonna say that, but you know what I mean. U10 would like to access your contacts. Say yes. Alright. Now your watch would say Connected, done. All right, then I'm starting to get all my notifications. It's on my phone coming through. Okay, so once that's done, I'm gonna go on and empty this. So just so you know, left on the swipe is okay, like empty. I'm click through. And it says delete all, and we'll swipe to the left for yes. Okay, that's done. So now my all my notifications just get going. All right, so go to, uh, okay, let me take this off where you can see. Okay, take and scroll through. Okay. Scroll through until you find settings.
the top one right there is language click that number one is English click that it's gonna say done all right so now your phone is set to English you can set your time right, my time is already set uh, scroll to the scroll to the right and it'll go back to the screen date my dates already set I must have got it all from my phone scroll to the right time format 12 hour 24 hour it's already set on 12 that's where I like it um, LCD backlit I'm gonna increase that so to stay lit uh, okay so we're done there all right now once you get your app installed and we're at this point you're gonna go and find that app and it's gonna be smartwatch you're gonna click that all right it's not gonna come up like this for you you're gonna have to install it uh, but it's gonna be two buttons um, you're gonna see that screen you'll see whenever it comes up but it's gonna be two buttons when you go to install it and the one on the left is yes there'll be a button on the right it's green that's cancel so hit the one on the left and then enter your information there it's going to ask you for like your weight it's going to ask you for that in kilograms so you need to figure out in kilograms how much you weigh uh, and you can go to google and say uh, for example 150 pounds equals how many kilograms and it'll give you that answer enter that in there um, so answer all those questions it's going to ask you for uh, your phone number an email address a password repeat the password and that's going to take you into the app uh, you're going to go once you get into here you're going to go to uh, push sets and you're going to put uh, a check beside notification service all right and then hit back um, You can hit that little tab there and it's going to open up a couple things there. Uh, in, my bind, in my basic set, I've got uh, check, check, uncheck, and check. Try that out. Uh, you're also going to need to... Uh, hang on, not that one. Hit the wrong button. All right, U10 smartwatch is bound. Uh, I'm trying to figure out what was it I done it at. Uh, customize. It's going to let you uh, name your watch. That's pretty much it. Uh, go, oh, oh yeah, okay. So here, go, uh, go to push set down here at the bottom. Go to accessibility settings. All right. And here, you're going to go down to uh, smartwatch. You're going to turn it on. All right, it's on hit it there then you can hit uh, uh, back and I believe that's it for that one uh, notification app yeah okay so here you want to click notification app click that it's going to load all your apps it's going to show you everything you got that you want to receive notifications from I like CNN breaking news my email, my eBay, my Facebook, uh, and the things I don't like, I uncheck. I don't want to hear from Tango or Voxer or any of those things, so they're unchecked. All right, so hit save down at the bottom, and uh, you should be good to go. Let me know if that don't put you into English mode. Thanks.